Good afternoon, everybody. This is a 0.81 acre lot that we got, um, at least on from North Charleston. And this is what it looks like less than three years later. And this is how we um, at Fresh Future Farm deal with food justice and environmental justice. If you look closely, we're standing on gla uh, grass and not wood chips because we have introduced um, wood chips to garden like a forest so that not, not only can we grow food without chemicals, but we can also absorb that water and not have it run off. I went from being somebody that used um, the food bank to somebody that worked there, promoting the idea that you didn't have to stand in line if you figured out how to grow your own stuff. So um, this is me with my coworkers. We, um, one of our first like healthy food distributions in front of the space that we now have our farm um, many years ago. And then this is the farm that we did on asphalt at the Azalea Drive location. I uh, went through the Master Gardener course, but I also learned a lot after that class. You study anything for 10,000 hours, you become an expert. Got, learned how to do chickens <laughs> on the interwebs. I learned about uh, this gentleman here. I'm standing on my tiptoes to be in that picture with him and my husband. That's Will Allen from Growing Power. They have 300 acres in Milwaukee. They are, that one thing I'm looking at there that is uh, microgreens, that one tray, they um, earn $16 for that in soil that they create themselves. This has become my motto. Like, um, I don't go to meetings about it, I just do it. <laughs> and if you, you want to talk to me, um, get a shovel. <laughs> I'm at the farm. This is our vision. What, um, if you were in the restaurant business, this is mise en, place, is please, mise en place in a space. We have a farm, a store, so we're only traveling a few feet. So our produce tastes better than you see at a tr traditional farm. And we want to put a certified kitchen. I just have, in the last year, trained 60 people to do what we're doing for themselves. And this is our grocery store. We recycle everything. This is the old Enterprise Rent-A-Car building that we've turned into a grocery store. You know, the folks thought that we were crazy because the only thing that's actually dug into the ground in our space is the building and the chicken coop. Everything else is planted above ground. And this is what it looked like when we started. And then you get to where we are today. Um, all from uh, just taking what we don't sell, we compost, we chop um, leaves, and we put it back into the system so that we are able to be productive with minimal resources, taking what people throw out to be able to grow um, food. All your problems can be solved in a garden, ladies and gentlemen. And that's what we do with Fresh Future Farm. <laughs>